So the next component in the MDM element is the diagnosis component. The diagnosis component is generally broken down into four items. These are the four items that you're going to use to characterize the type of diagnoses conditions that your patient is suffering from or with. Established diagnoses that are either stable or unstable, and then new diagnoses that are either going to be worked up by you or not worked up by you. Those are the four items in general for the diagnosis component. Each item gets a point, a certain number of points actually, and you add up these points to determine your total points for the diagnosis component. There's a minimum number of points you need for the diagnosis component in order to put yourself in position for level 4 billing, and that is 3 points. So it's easy to remember, you need 3 points added up for data, 3 points added up for diagnosis, and that'll put your MDM element in position for level 4 billing. So what are these points? For every established problem that's stable, you get a point. For every established problem that's unstable, you get two points. For every new problem that you're not going to work up, say for example you're going to refer to someone else to do the workup, three points. And for every new problem that you are going to work up, four points. You need a minimum of three to put yourself in position to bill for a level four. So let's walk through two scenarios, one with an established patient, one with a new patient, to determine how you can get three points or more. If your patient is a return patient, an established patient, they may still have a new problem. But in this example, they're going to walk in with CKD and hypertension, which is what they've had for years, and you've been caring for both those conditions for years. Thankfully, their CKD is stable. That's one problem underneath this item for a total of one point. But their hypertension is unstable because it was the holidays, for example, and they ate a lot of salt. So that's one problem that's unstable, two points. That's a total of three points, and that gets you to the number you need to be at to get your MDM element in position for level four billing. Now say you have a brand new patient, and you've never seen this patient before, and they've got a new problem. It's AKI, or even newly diagnosed CKD and newly diagnosed by you. That's one problem that you're most likely going to work up, and so that's four points. And you've automatically met your threshold of three points for level four billing. So in the diagnosis component, your diagnoses will have to satisfy one of these four items. And you multiply the number of diagnoses in each item by the point value per item to hopefully get a minimum score of three points or more. In the last video, we're going to talk about the risk, and then we're going to summarize everything that I hopefully have taught you thus far uh, so that you can bill a level four.